guys so I have everything kind of laid out already and I will just show you guys how I pack everything in a carry-on and then I'm gonna show you guys my carry-on personal item which is my bag right here or my tote so anyways this is all the clothes that I have for I think it's from Thursday up until Monday so I kind of have two outfits picked out per day just because we are doing dinner at night time so I kind of wanted to dress up a little bit better for dinner so I do have two outfits a day a lot of the clothes I actually showed you guys in my haul so go ahead and check that out I will have it linked for you guys down below and there's my cat <laughs> so yeah and then these are all the accessories which I will go through in a little bit so for right now we are going to put all of these into this side of the suitcase okay <laughs> i know it looks so messy right now but pretty much all of these clothes i'm gonna be folding really nicely onto this side this sweatshirt right here i'm actually not gonna pack because i'm wearing this on thursday on the flight and also i'm gonna wear this probably on the way back home as well so this is not gonna go in the suitcase set that aside all right, so I'm gonna start off with dresses, actually, if I can find it in my pile. All right, so this right here is a really, really long dress, like this. And as you can see, it's like chiffon material. A lot of the clothing pieces I'm packing are actually really, really thin material. Plus, I'm going somewhere really warm, so I don't wanna pack anything too thick anyways. So this really long dress, I'm gonna fold in half just like that and I'm gonna try and fold it again in half just like that okay and these are the other two dresses that I have and they're also very nice and flowy as well so here we go I'm gonna go ahead and try and fold this one in half like this and, just, and that's it. I'm not going to fold it anymore because this one I don't want to tear anything as well. Same with this dress. I'm going to fold it in half and find the top of it. Alright, so. Alright. Make this one like this as well. Fold that in half. There we go. So those are all the dresses. And then this is a romper. Which I'm going to do in a sec. Um, let's see. I'm going to fold this one. This one, you don't really have to fold that nicely because it doesn't matter. Like this fabric is very, very wrinkle friendly. I guess. And look at that, it's so thin. All right, so I'm just gonna actually put this right there. <clears throat> I also have this beach cover up type of thing. And as you can see, you can scrunch, scrunch this up. The ball, right there. Okay, let's see here. This one is a romper. So I'm gonna fold this nicely, as nice as possible. I'm gonna go like this. Let's see. Okay, and the sleeves here. I'm gonna just go like that. All right. Still lots of room here, you can squish it down. Um, I have a few tops that are very thin as well. I'm gonna fold it like that. I have this top, it's already folded, but I'll do that in a bit. Shorts right here. I have this, this is like my sleepwear right here. It's just a long kind of like dress. It's from a dormy, it's so cute. So it's like a little nighty. So that is my sleepwear. I have this top, which is okay. It doesn't matter how you fold it as well. So I'm gonna go ahead, put that here onto the side. All right now this top, over there. These shorts I'm actually gonna wear on the plane, I think. So I'm not gonna pack that, but I am going to pack these ones. There we go. And I have this beach cover up right here, which this one gets so wrinkly so fast so i'm gonna go ahead and just fold this one as nicely as possible as well okay that's not working <laughs> it's still so big all right that's good enough i think and then i have this top right here which doesn't matter okay and then i also have my swimsuit tops right here i have two of them just the tops so i'm gonna go ahead and like put that here on the side or something Okay, and then on this side, I'm also going to put my clutches. I'm bringing two clutches. 
I have here my long chomp and this is the large or no the medium I think with the long handle or is this the large I think this is the large yeah I have the large so I'm gonna go ahead and put that here I think or am I gonna put it I'll put it up here actually fits better okay and I'm gonna go ahead and close this up and as you can see, I already have stuff in here. So these are all of my um, undergarments. So I have my underwear, bralettes, a pair of socks. I have more swimsuits right here, like a one piece and some more tops and then swimsuit bottoms. So I have those there. And then now onto this side, five pairs of shoes and it will all fit. So I have two that are kind of like wedges. And then these I'm gonna pack to all together in a dust bag. So I have these. This and this. So I'll just go into the dust bag. Just like that. I'm gonna put it right here. Okay. And then these wedges, I'm gonna put right here. They fit right there really nicely, as you can see. So those are my wedges. And then I have here my traveling um, hair dryer. Looks like this. It's really good. Even if you have thick hair, this will dry your hair really quick. There's a little nozzle for it. But yeah, it just folds up like that. It's so easy and compact. I love this hair dryer for traveling. Okay, so that's going to go right here. Okay, I have here my Huggies wipes. This is actually where I'm going to be putting my makeup brushes. This is a Huggies Wipes container. And I think I showed this to you guys before, but all your brushes, or all my brushes at least, fits in here and they all lay nice and flat. And this is like, you know, something that will not stretch. So this is really the only room that, you know, this will take up, which I love. So I'm gonna put that right there. And then um, I have here, my makeup bag, which I will go through in a second um, or after this, but it's just gonna go right there. I also have here a, a little pouch, or not really little, it's pretty big, but it has all of like my bathroom essentials. Um, so I have extra Ziploc bags. Uh, actually, I'll go through this in a second as well, but yeah, so it just has that. And I have here my curling iron. And that's gonna go right here. There we go. And that is it for my suitcase, you guys. So yeah, I'll go through these bags in a second, but that's everything that's in my suitcase. This is all good to go. All right, so this is my um, makeup bag right here. This is from the Cosmetics, and I'm just gonna show you guys everything that I am bringing. So we have two palettes, um, one from Tarte and Butter London right here. This has eyeshadow and a blush. And then this one is my bronzer palette. So I have those two. I have my BH Studio Pro powder. I have my Pure Cosmetics Air Perfection. This is a cushion foundation. I love it so much. I'm in the color medium. So those four things. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in there. I have a little mirror. I have here my Bare Minerals Well Rested Concealer. It's a loose powder. And also I have the Bare Skin Concealer from Bare Minerals. Will Techniques Sponge. I have a few brow products. So I have the Wonder Brow, the Anastasia Brow Gel, and also the it Cosmetics Brow Power Pencil. So those are for my brows. Oh, and the concealer for my brows. I use this for correcting just in case it's the Lorac concealer. All right, I have four lip products for our nude, or no, five lip products. Pretty much all nudes, except for this one. This is from Lancome. It's like a hot pink color. Um, but yeah, so I have Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid and then three Jouer Lip Creams. I have two lip balms, the Sun Balm and Soft Lips. Both have SPF. This one from Soft Lips has SPF 15, I believe. And this one from Sun Balm has SPF 30. I have three mascaras. This one from Neutrogena 
um, is waterproof and these two are from It Cosmetics. They're just like travel size. I have tools here. So I have a tweezer for my brows, a little razor, and um, eyelash curler. And then my Leo Valley brush pen liner and an eye pencil. So that's everything that was in here. Alright guys, so in this pouch, I have kind of like my emergency things and all that. So I got this from Clarisonic. It came with my Clarisonic Aria. So yeah, I like it a lot. But anyways, in here I have extra Ziploc bags. So just small ones. And then I have this Ziploc bag that contains um, Q-tips, extra tampons, floss. I have a sewing kit in there and everything. Um, some hair ties, clips, a, what's this called, like those bra tapes. I have a nail filer, um, everything you would need. I have like a band-aid in here as well. Um, nail polish remover on the go. So that's pretty much, you know, like a little emergency Ziploc bag that I have. And then I also have in here these heel type of guard things for shoes in case I need it. Not that I do, but just in case. Um, I also have, well, it's not in here, but this is where I put like my stick-ons for my, you know, the bra stick-ons. <laughs> I have here erasers. So that's just, you know, I have two disposable erasers. Yes, you can pack these. I always do. I have my toothbrush in here as well and more q-tips because I I don't know just in case <laughs> so yeah I have more q-tips all right hi guys so I'm on the floor no makeup on right now just because I have so many things to do today and packing is one of them so anyways you guys already saw the suitcase and everything that's gonna go in there and now I'm gonna show you guys what's in my personal carry-on so this is the never full mm and I have everything in here already, so let's go. All right, so I have here just my phone. I just have a pink case on it right now. So that's the iPhone 6. And then I also have this guy right here. This has all of my electronics, um, so all the chargers and all that stuff. So this is just what it looks like. I got this from a skincare product line thing. I don't know. Perfect though, it fits everything. So I have here my Polaroid thingy. It's kind of like a GoPro, so it's in the waterproof case right now. I guess it looks like that. Um, I need to get like a tripod for this, like this one. This is my vlogging camera. So yeah, I need to get a little tripod for this guy right here. But anyways, I have that. And then I have here my phone charger with the cord and everything. Um, I have here, what is this for? My vlogging camera charger. And then I have other cords in here. And then in the zip pocket right here, I have instructions on how to use the Polaroid cube because I've never used it before. Um, I also have this. This is a portable charger. And I actually got this from the Maybelline package that I received a few months ago. So I'm using that. It's really good. And as you can see, it's really small. So I just have it in there. Okay, next I have here this guy. I'm sure you guys have seen this before. I've shown it to you a ton of times, but this is where I keep all of my liquids. Um, if you didn't notice, I didn't have any like liquid foundations or moisturizers in my makeup bag because I like to keep all the liquids in one bag. And I actually got this bag from Airpostal a few years back and it's perfect. I've used this so many times traveling, I think the past three years. So yeah, it's holding up really well. I love it a lot. So anyways, just to go through it with you guys, I have my Murad Oil Control Mattifier. I have the Murad Clarifying Cleanser. This is not sponsored. I just really love Murad. It's what I always use and yeah. So I have those. They're all like, you know, under three ounces. This is the Murad Invisibler Perfecting Shield. I have my Makeup Forever Mist and Fix to um, set my makeup and everything. I have my deodorant um, travel size. I have here the Kate Spade Walk on Air Roller Ball and I love traveling with ro roller balls just because it's easier than like a spray or anything like that so that is that. 
I have my sunscreen and this is from Pure and this is the Rescue Squad DD Cream and it's good for face and body and it has SPF 25 so that is my sunscreen. I'm probably going to buy something else later but that's what I'm packing. I have my Murad Rejuvenating um, AHA Hand Cream. I love this hand cream. I have my Polish Choice Skin Balancing Invisible Finish Moisture Gel. I've talked about this before. I love it a lot. I have my toothpaste and also a CC cream from It Cosmetics. And this is actually a shade darker than what I am right now. I know I'm going to get tanner, so I have a thing with me just in case. And also for, you know, just traveling and stuff like that, I like to bring these guys with me. I get these all the time at TJ Maxx. This is the brand. I'll have it written down below, but I always get these at TJ Maxx. They're very inexpensive, and they're like little eye gel thingies. I love them. And I do have one face mask in here, and I don't know the brand, but that's the face mask I'm bringing. I really like this. I used it before, and I love it. Okay, next I have my wallet and also my crossbody bag. Um, I know I have like two clutches already in my <laughs> carry-on, but... Girls gotta have options, you know. So I have here my wallet and also this can be turned into a crossbody like I said. So this is the Louis Vuitton Pochette Felicie. I did a whole video on it, so I'll link it for you guys down below. But this is what it looks like. And inside I just have my passport. I took it out of the um, passport holder just because, you know, I don't want it to be so bulky and take up so much room. I have the card holder with all my cards and also cash inside so that is that and i also have um this guy for my coins so yeah that's that um if you're wondering what this is this is a pouch that comes from the felici um this one came with one as well but it's in the damier azul print with the light pink interior and that one gets so dirty from the coins so fast that i went ahead and um purchased this one um you know the felici comes in monogram print so i went ahead and got just the insert um for my coins so that is that this is what's in here and the uh the straps for this i have in the pocket in here which i'll show you in a bit i also have here my ipad so i can watch movies and tv shows and whatnot so that's my ipad this is i forgot like the ipad mini and the case i got from amazon and I want to show you guys this. Um, I got a liner for my Never Full a while ago. And I've been using it for maybe two or three months now. And I love it. It's just so good because then, you know, my the bottom of my purse is clean. So this is it right here. I don't know where to get it. But I got it from a Facebook group, which I'll link for you guys down below. I always look on there. But... Yeah, I bought this off of somebody and it works perfectly. I love it because it's not bulky or anything. It doesn't add weight to my bag. So yeah, I just put it right there and it's perfect, you know. My purse can still be squished if I want to. I love it. It's not like one of those big liners that you can find. So anyways, yeah, I got that from a Facebook group. But okay, I also have a few more things in here. In the pocket compartment right here, the zipper part, I have my keys. So this is the six key holder. And I just have my car keys and house keys and all that in there. So that's going to stay in there. I also have my headphones. Um, these are the oh, Layla. No, not the Layla. But they're from Friends. Um, it has the gold, the rose gold thing right there, like the earbuds. So those are my headphones. I really like how it's like in this little um, pouch. I have here a watch. This is just my Daniel Wellington watch. I love this watch, you guys. And if I have a coupon code for you, I'll have it there as well. But I love this watch. I've been wearing it nonstop. So I'm bringing that. This is the, um, the chain for my Philly C. I also have a few pairs of earrings in here. A lot of them are just House of Harlow earrings. Um, I guess like studs. So those are the earrings I'm bringing. And that is it. That's everything that was in my personal carry-on. Not a whole lot this time, you guys. Traveling really lightly. All right, guys. So this is how everything looks like when it's all in my purse. Look how nicely everything fits. Oh my gosh. I'm like obsessed. 
I love it. So that is my personal carry-on item. And that is it, you guys. That's everything that I'm packing for my trip this weekend. I am so excited to go on this cruise. It has been forever since I've been on one. I'm going with my girlfriend, so it's just gonna be so, so, so much fun. Thank you guys again for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this and find it helpful. Feel free to leave me a video request or any questions or comments down below. I can't wait to hear back from you guys, and I will see you guys soon. Bye!